welcome back again students now we are here with the explanation of part third of the lesson children at work in the first two parts we have seen that velu is a 11 year old boy who left his home because his father used to beat him and snatch his all money and when he reached to the chennai central he met a girl whose name was jaya and basically she is a rag picker and she led him to the central jail and after that both of them went to a marriage hall where both of them ate some of the leftover food of the others now we will try to find out what happens in the third paragraph we are going to start it there are some clues for you like the first one there is a row of herds near some dirty puddles outside one of the herds jaya dumps her sack grateful to his friend velu thinks of the days ahead now we will move towards the text jaya and velu walked along the roads for half an hour until they came to a bridge across a dirty trickle of water we are in triple k now see that is buckingham canal said jaya so what happens last time in the previous paragraph we have studied that they ate vada and banana that was rotten banana so they ate these things which was left over of others after that both of them walked on the road for half an hour and they reached near a bridge again and there was a dirty trickle of water trickle means stream and jaya is indicating towards a triple k she is saying that now we are in triple k it is a name of place and there was the famous buckingham canal now we will move to the next paragraph velu stared this was a canal near some puddles of water was a row of strangest huts he had ever seen they were built out of all sort of things like metal streets metal sheets tires bricks wood and plastic they stood crook they stood crookedly and looked as if they would fall any moment after that both of them jaya and velu reached near the puddle of water and they saw there were some strange herds strange means which is different from others there was only herds but that kind of herds velu had never seen they were built out they were built out of all sort of things like metal sheets tires bricks wood and plastic and the condition of these herds were very bad and it was looking like that they can fell down in any moment now we will move to the next in this where you live these houses are strange said velu in our village the houses are made of mud and palm leaves now velu is asking to jaya that is this the village you live I mean is this the houses in uh, these are the houses in which you live and velu is telling about his houses that they are used to live in houses which are made up of mud and palm trees but the houses where jaya used to live they were made up of metal sheets tire bricks wood and plastic so that is why he was very much surprised to see that kind of herds jaya went around to one of the herds and dumped her sack outside then she picked up an empty one and after that she said let's go so jaya used to live there and uh, a weak house means a not well maintained house she used to live in a not well maintained house basically it was not a house it was a hut so she dumped her sack there and picked another one 
electron there sec as you already know which I have already indicated in the picture. Let me show you which one is sec uh, this one this is called sec. Okay, now we will move to the explanation then Jaya said to Velu let us go. She turned to Velu and gave him a shove, shove means push at least help me now here wear these and come with me. So, Jaya is saying to Velu that at least you should help me and uh, you should wear these things and you should go with me, you should come with me. She threw him a pair of old shoes without laces and pushed a shack and a stick into his hands. Velu was confused. What work did she want him to do with these things? The only work he had ever done was on the landowner's farm weeding and taking cows out to graze. So, Velu was confused while Jaya was throwing a pair of shoes which was without laces and she also pushed a sack and a stick to his hands and he was confused that what work Jaya want him to do. He was totally confused. He was unable to think what was he going to do now and he only knows only knows to do only one work that was the, the work of land the, that was the work on the landowner's farm. He used to do the work of weeding and taking cows out to graze. Now he is asking that are there any farms in the city he asked Jaya means Velu he does not know any other things that is why he asked that because he only knows only one work to take out the cows to the graze. So that is why he was asking to Jaya that are there any farms in the city then what happens after that we will try to find out in the next paragraph. She laughed and thumped her stick on the ground farms there are no farmers we are rack pickers. So this time Jaya first time is telling about his identity that there are not any farms and there are not any farmers and they are rack pickers. Then Velu is surprised and asking rack pickers? Then Jaya is saying see my sack full of things I collected. Then Velu is asking collected from where? Asked. So, Velu asked him that you have collected these things and from where you have collected these things? And from rubbish bins where else Jaya is saying that we have collected all these things from the rubbish bins. You collect rubbish Velu had never heard of such things. So, Velu is confused he is shocked that why people are collecting rubbish basically human beings throw rubbish out of their homes. But Jaya was telling that she has collected the rubbish from the garbage bins. Now what happens next? A blockhead, it is not any rubbish, only paper, plastic, glass, such things. We sell it to Jam Bajar Jaggu. Now, this time Jaya is explaining to him that a blockhead, blockhead means fool. So, she wants to say that you are just a fool, this is not the rubbish, these are only papers, plastic, glass, and these kind of things, and we sell these papers and plastic and glasses to. Jam Bajar Jaggu. Jam Bajar Jaggu is the name of a person. Okay, now next one. Velu was puzzled. He had heard of people throwing away rubbish, but why would anyone want to buy rubbish? He was puzzled. Puzzled means confused. So, he was confused that people used to throw out the garbage, the rubbish. But why these ones, why someone, why a person like Jam Bajar Jaggu is uh, sorry want to buy these rubbish? He was confused. So, what happens next? He asked to Jaya that who is Jam Bajar Jaggu? Why is he buying all this? Now, Jaya answered him that you think he buys it for sure? He sells to a factory. Come on, I do not have time to waste like you. So, Jaya explained him that he does not buy these things to show. He also take these things and he 
sell these things to a factory and after that she instruct Velu to come with him and don't waste her time. Now next Velu did not move and had not run away and come to this new place to dig through garbage bins Jaya poked at him with her stick. So what happens? Velu did not move this time and he had not run away from his home to do that kind of work. But Jaya poked at him with her stick. Look here, she shouted. Jaya shouted to his Velu that if someone gets there before us, we don't get anything. Don't just stand here posing, big hero. I am trying to help you. Who filled your stomach today? Then Jaya is shouting to him. And she was saying that if someone will reach there before us, they will get the papers, glass, plastic and other things. We will not get anything. That is why she is saying that don't pose here. Big hero, don't pose here. And uh, she also said Velu that she is trying to help him. And she also making the mind that who filled your stomach today? Velu scratched his head and child. I will do it for now, he thought, until I find a better job. So, Velu, as you know, that he had not any opportunity and he doesn't know anyone in the city. So, he decided to do that work, but he was not happy in that. He thought that until he find a better job, he will do that job. While he will get a good job, he will leave the work of rag picking. So, there are some comprehensional check questions for you. What material are the strange hurts made of? We have already discussed that the strange hurts where Jaya used to live that was made of metal sheets, bricks, wood and plastic. The second question, second part of question number 1. Why does Velu find them strange? So, we, you can write down answer like this. Velu finds those hurts strange because his own village. The hurts were made of mud and palm trees. Now, question number two: What sort of things did Jaya and children like her collect, and what did they do with those things? So, you can write down like this: Jaya and other children like her collected paper, plastic, and glass. They sold all these to a kabadi wala like jam bajar jaggu now the next one is velu happy or unhappy to find work give a reason for your answers so velu as you know that was not happy at all he had never done such a dirty job in his village and at last sentence you can understand that he was saying it i will do it for now he thought until I found a better job means he was not happy to do the work of rag picker. Now the next one there are some questions in the exercise section. Question number one is Velu a smart boy which instances in the text so that he is or he isn't. So as you have already understood that Velu is not a smart boy. He ran away from his home to escape his father's beating. He felt miserable at the railway station. He also found himself alone and hungry. He accepted rag picking because he wasn't fit for any other job. So these instances shows that he was not an intelligent one. He is not a smart boy. The second question, do you think Jaya is a brave and sensitive child with a sense of humor? find instances of her courage, kind nature and humor in the text. Yes, we can say that Jaya is a brave and sensitive girl. She takes pity on Velu, means she show kindness on Velu and gets food for him. She herself earns her livelihood, livelihood very bravely by collecting discarded material or thrown material of other people. And she has also a sense of humor also. She calls the dirty trickle of water Buckingham Canal, which shows that she was a smart girl. 
Now question number 3. What one throws away as waste may be valuable to others. Do you find this sentence meaningful in the context of this story? Why? Yes, the plastic, the paper and rusty metal seeds thrown away by the people become valuable to rag pickers as you know that they made their hurts with these metals, plastic and thrown material. They ate leftover food of survival. They sell junk food to some dealer to eat their livelihood. So, this was the complete explanation of the lesson. Now, you have to write down the word meanings from the text which are already given there these ones and I will provide you the question answers and you have to write down it and you will submit the word meaning and question answer day before uh, in your next class. So, study well at your homes and stay safe.